Hey guys, this is Ezfat9 and welcome back to another video. And today's video, I'm showing you guys how you can easily find balloons in Anthos in New Horizons. So, yeah. So guys, you may have seen the balloons that are flying across your island and I'm going to show you a technique so you can shoot the most of those balloons down. And yeah, you may want to do that guys if you are trying to find all of the DIYs from a DIY set because they are time based so you may be trying to find all DIYs in the DIY set and you want to try to find the most as quick as you can so yeah let's get started so guys before we start collecting our balloons I want to let you know that the balloons switch what side of your island they fly in from two times per day so when the sun's up or it's 6 a.m to 6 p.m. they fly in from one side and when the sun's down or from 6 p.m. to 5 a.m. they fly in from the other side if you're unsure guys of what side of your island the blue fly in from you can look at a villager's house and see which way the steams go in and that's the same way that the balloons were flying so yeah as well as, guys, I probably should mention that you will need a slingshot. So, first of all, guys, for our technique, we need to go into a building at a time that ends in either 3 or 8. So, for example, 13 or 18 minutes. So, if I check what the time is now. So, guys, as you can see, the time has just changed to end in a three like i said before it can end in a three or an eight so yeah we need to go to this building guys which in this case in museum it can be a villager's house so whatever's closest and then we just need to talk to the npc so in this case blathers and yeah you don't need to assist us in any way blathers we just came for a chat yeah and now guys we just need to wait until the time says 304 or a minute has passed so yeah let's just wait for a minute to pass so guys now a minute has passed we need to go outside and wait for the time to end in a zero or a five so in this case it's going to be a five and yeah bear in mind guys that the balloon doesn't spawn in every time this tactic only makes it more likely for a balloon to spawn in but it doesn't guarantee the balloon spawning so just wanted to let you guys know that and yeah when it hits guys zero or five at the end we just need to run up and down our beach or i need to run up and down the beach until we see a balloon flying so yeah I also want to let you know, guys, that a balloon doesn't just... Oh, time's changed. Yeah, a balloon doesn't just give you DIYs. It does give you other items as well. So, yeah, we won't get a DIY every time, guys. So, this is one reason why this tactic's helpful. Oh, and Daisy May's down here. I haven't actually burnt, burnt my turnips. Yeah, I'm not cooking my turnips. I haven't actually bought my turnips yet this week, guys. So, we should do that in a bit. Yeah. I'm just going to run up and down, guys, until I see the balloon. And... Oh, can I hear it? Oh. I can see its shadow. Where is it? Oh, there it is. And then, guys, we just need to shoot it down with our slingshot. And then... Let's see. What is it? Oh, it's a DIY! Yay! And then you can just learn the DIY, which will obviously then go onto your nut phone. So, yeah. Like I said, guys, it doesn't always have DIY, so that time we just got a bit lucky. So, yeah. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and yeah, I'll catch you in the next one. Bye, guys!